I did attempt college, but I realized that college is quite expensive. <laughs> and I was being taken care of by a single mom at the time. After high school, I had random jobs and I ended up having my child when I was 24. And, you know, life was a lot different um, as a parent and especially as a young parent. There are a variety of um, different things that the 110 program has to support students from technical support to motivation to peer support to project support. It's really endless and a great program for students who maybe don't have the background of being um, at a university or getting that education at a higher level. Even when I really didn't understand a project and I was just like, I don't know how I'm going to do this. This is a lot. Even when I didn't really understand what I was doing, I would always submit it and getting that feedback always put me back on the right track. On Slack, we have session leads, which are the technical help to the nano degree. So you can come on Slack at any time of the day and ask your session leads questions. And sometimes they're there live and they can give you answers right away. Sometimes it may just take um, a few hours for them to get back to you. I lost my job in 2020 because of the pandemic. Now I'm on the Google News Media team. Honestly, I could not have believed that I would have gotten this position, especially a year before I literally had no idea what I was going to do next. Um, and I think Udacity came at the right time. And Udacity also kind of allowed me to not be crippled by what I didn't know. Um, because I had gained so much in that experience, I was like, you know what, I'm going to take a chance and I'm going to apply. I had a blast doing the course. If I could take it again, I probably would because it was that much fun.